Um, so the Internet of Things is too hard, and what is missing is the ability for someone who doesn't give a damn about electronics to prototype. And what I thought would be fun to do was a really simple set of uh, controllers, because everything in the Internet of Things, basically every sensor is just reading a floating point. Every uh, house controller is effectively a floating point number sensor in the thermostat and a couple of switches. It switches, it's buttons, it's a couple of sensors. It's, it's like an HTML form. There's not much complexity to this, and that's good. And then why do I get a box of wires? Why can't I just get a box which doesn't have to talk to if this, then that, but I can make it talk to something which I can code the prototype on? I'm not interested in security, self security. <laughs> what I thought would be fun, and at the very simplest level, is an on off switch and a light. And an on off switch that can turn on any kind of on or off sensor, like the door sensor and stuff in this box, that can turn something on and off via an API that would be simple and insecurity like, and a switch, something that can be turned on and off, like a lamp, like a what LED. But as well as having a physical object, I thought it'd be good to have some in game objects in Minecraft that works identically. So you can give a school this or a research lab, and they can have 2,000 of these sensors if they want to test them without having to buy them. And they can, so we can do rapid prototyping of Internet of Things ideas in real space and in virtual space. But mostly, I want to switch on this that I turn on and off and the light goes on and off in the game. And I switch on the game, I turn on and off and the LED goes on and off. It's just like nifty. <laughs> so, I can code uh, for things. I've just managed to make a Minecraft Hello World mod that prints the name of a dirt block. I spent all day getting to that point. Um, I've never worked with any of these, so the skills needed would be a bit of application, a bit of system skills of what the protocol should be, but frankly, whatever the hell we can get working in a day. Plus, making that thing do a thing, making Minecraft do a thing, which I'm hoping I can do, this Java, and I've not seen Java since um, the, the, the O'Reilly book turns red since I last knew a lot about Java. Um, it used to be brown. And um, <laughs> I'm one volume, you think. And um, also, um, I thought this would be good to get you could do a web interface, you could do a mobile app, uh, Android or iPhone interface, because it's just an on off switch and a light. And how many different applications could we build that provide the same API to an on off switch and a light for rapid IoT prototyping?